probably didn't plan on coming back here, eh? Well, plans do change, no? Are you angry? You're angry. There is this one thing I must do before I can recover the ember. Before? This is not a negotiation, Louis, so choose your next words carefully. Whoa. Listen, there is someone who needs my help. You know me, always the good Samaritan. Let me guess, Leon? Yes, exactly. Leon and that young woman, they are both infected. They need this medicine. It slows the infection, and I know it works. I used it on myself. So Why I... does this matter to me? Because you two are infected. It's what I researched for all these years, Ada, and I see the symptoms already showing in your eyes. You must already feel the effects, eh? The medicine will stop them for a time. Just trust me. You have a lot to gain and nothing to lose. Okay, but this is your last chance. We do this first, and then the Amber. No, no, no! We can't let the medicine be destroyed! Luis, let it go! <sighs> Luis! You do it after you delivered the amber. It's all gone. Burnt to nothing. Why is this so important to you? There are things I must set right. But that is impossible now. It's all over. And I can't help them anymore. Pull yourself together, Luis. Make more. You know how, just do it. Yes, it is possible. The ingredients are all here, in the castle. Yes, I need time, but I can still get you your Amber. All right then, let's go. Be my finest effort, but it might just work. Ada, find these ingredients. Just maybe I can make a new batch of medicine. Time's not our friend. You go. Find them, and I will go grab the ember. Wish me luck. Right there, Leon. Would it make me use this? Would you? Well, after six years, that is one hell of a greeting, Ada. You don't seem surprised. Interesting. <laughs> Try using knives next time. Better for close encounters. Not a bad move. Very smooth. So who are you working for this time? Oh, Leon. You know I don't work in town.
Leave the girl. She's lost no matter what. You walk away now, and who knows? Maybe you'll live to meet me again, and then I might get you that greeting you were looking for. You think I'm gonna give up that easy? Right. How about we continue this discussion another time? That's right. I still have some unfinished business to take care of. Sorry, nothing yet. But my little helper is creating quite the commotion. Everything will work out just fine. As long as you can keep your dog under control. He's a good boy. Predictable. Fine. Keep your mutt. But don't come crying to me if you get bit. Leon, changed your mind yet? Yeah. Assuming you haven't, I've got a tip for you. Seems like something big is about to go down in the throne room. Babysitting's tough, huh? <sighs> got everything you need. Good. I got exactly what you want. Ah. Oh, that's not good. The parasite is reacting to the amber. So that's the amber. That looks like something Wesker would want. This will knock out the parasite, but only for a time. You ready? A tu salud. Just remember, it's not a cure. We still need to find a way to get that thing out of you. Once the parasite is sedated, you can give me back that damn stone. I can't leave you here. Not like this. Spare me. I'll be fine. You got another promise to keep. All right. But you come find me. As soon as you're done here.
thing down. to end this for good. Leon, there's only time to say this once, so listen up. They took your friend to the top of the clock tower. If you hurry, you might get there before she turns into one of them. Uh, so you aren't heartless after all. I guess I should be thankful. Yeah, you should. something to say I have something to ask you but I don't think I'll get a straight answer raccoon city you know after the incident the world changed you try to save one person a hundred others die 
I guess I changed too. <laughs> you. Leon S. Kennedy. You haven't changed. You just think you have. So here's my question. Have you changed, Ada? Or are you just trying to use me again? What do you think? We're here. Don't think too hard, handsome. See you later. Story of my life.